Supporters of the pro-life movement gathered in Macon today to advocate for the end of abortion. 41 NBC's Andrew Willis was at Rosa Parks Square to learn more about the March for Life rally and what resources are available to expecting and new mothers in middle Georgia. People are happy to have the opportunity to come out and express their beliefs. For nearly a decade, members of the pro-life community have rallied in Macon for the end of abortion as part of the March for Life event. Each year, the faith-based march is hosted by the Colby Center, which serves as a resource for families in middle Georgia. The center's director, Ann Beal, says the event is held in remembrance of babies lost to abortion and to bring visibility to the pro-life movement. We still believe that every life is valuable and we are here today to remind our community of that. More than 100 people gathered at Rosa Parks Square this year to participate in the march. Beale says the event brings people together for a united cause. The pro-life community knows no religious bounds. Um, we, have, we have all sorts of people who want to support us and are thankful for that opportunity. Beale explains the March for Life also raises awareness for the Colby Center and the services it provides. The center helps expecting mothers and parents with baby supplies medical services and community support. We help mamas figure out um, what the next step is. Sometimes that looks like connecting them with an adoption agency. Other times that is making sure that they have the resources they need to get medical care. In Macon, Andrew Willis, 41 NBC News. And Beale encourages anyone opposed to the pro-life movement to learn more about the Colby Center and how it offers support to mothers. You can visit their website, colbycentermacon.org. We'll have that at 41nbc.com.